What is up, everybody? We are back yet again, as promised. Thank you guys for tuning in and checking these buttons. We got that special Street Fighter V announcement. This literally just happened, so we're gonna cut straight to it. Button change. Like, they're showing us stuff they never really showed us before. Almost, it's, it feels like it's filler. You know what I'm saying? It's footage to at least give us something. Here we go. Here's some gameplay. I guess they're showing the normals right now. Okay. Her standing HP is called Soul Breeze. It has some good reach. This is good. At least they're showing us this so far. Her slide is also good shape. Has strong compatibility. Her projectile, Soul Spark. Of course they had to have that. Okay. She could throw it in the air. I wanna see the critical art. Or show me a combo, baby. Here's what I don't understand though, is why do it like this? This is what usually happens after the trailer, after the hype. You know what I'm saying? It seems like they got enough here to already do a trailer for her. So why not do the trailer and get the hype and then you could do a whole nother stream for the breakdown. I don't understand why, are we gonna get the trailer later? You know? I kinda kill some of the hype, I think. What do y'all think about that, man? See this right here, we like that shit. You, you just showed us something and it was like six, seven seconds, but that was cool. But, yes, give us something more. Okay, he can cancel out the special moves. That's dope. Oh shit. Oh. I like that, because I'm all about the cancel. I love that shit. Oh, looking crispy. That's a hell of a fireball. Fuck. I was about to say, does it have some juggle effect? Because it looks like it does. Right here. Boom! Okay. Okay, armor breaker. Woo! That was juicy. Okay, 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 okay. He looks fun so far, right? He looks pretty fun. Something different, I like that. Woo! I wonder who's playing these characters. Mm, mm! Throw his ass in front of you. <laughs> the roll, all right. Nice. Ooh, light him up. In the corner. Juggle. That's your ass. Wake up, throw. Activate. Throw again, you're at your ass. Oh shit. <laughs> That's what's up. Chat going crazy right now, like, what the fuck? Next, you saw in the last battle is our new battle mechanic called V Swift. That's the new mechanic? V Swift. Hello, my name is, I can't pronounce that. I'm the battle director for Street Fighter V. Some people call me. I can't pronounce it either. Please allow me to explain further. Ooh, that's the new mechanic? 
defensive mechanism that is executed by consuming vitro while another defense system because of vitro directly exists. Holy shit. The chat's going crazy right now. Can be activated when blocking against the opponent's attack. There hasn't been a system yet that can be activated freely when a player is getting pressured. Holy shit. Holy shit. Some people are saying Ultra Instinct. V-Swift is a defensive system that can be activated anytime by consuming a bar of V-Gage when the player is in their normal state. For a short period of time after activation, V-Swift makes the player invincible to throws and also evades body blows and projectiles. What the fuck? When activating at the same time as opponents attack, both characters will go into slow motion and will make activating characters invincible until the animation is complete. Ooh, kind of like that slow-mo Tekken feel. Also, while characters in slow motion state, they can follow with an attack called the V-Swift Break. As explained here, V-Swift has various characteristics. Besides simply distance yourself during a sticky situation, it also can be utilized strategically to deal with certain characters. Oh, that was... Oh my God. When does this shit come out? Oh my God. This is gonna add some shit to the game. Some more calculated moves and more guessing. Next time I will speak to upcoming That I'm looking forward to. I was looking forward to something, like I said, Critical R2, no, because it's still gonna feel like the same game. This makes it feel almost like a different game. So far, that is. Okay. So a little longer wait. Season five is going to be our final season. All right, with that being said, y'all, um, like I said, I think it would have been dope if they would have shown some trailers because that's what we're used to, that's what we want. I think they had enough there to make a trailer. Hell, you see members of the FTC making trailers less, you know what I'm saying? I think they could have did something dope and then explained it. That would have been hype, man. I don't know why they did it like that. But all in all, the new mechanic makes it feel, so far, like it plays like a different game. And I think that's going to be exciting now. Time will only tell if it's gonna make the game worse or people are gonna hate it or if it's definitely gonna feel like something new to revitalize the game. That it is, ladies and gents. Definitely let me know how you feel, man. I'm excited about the new mechanic. That's it. I think Dan is exciting because he's gonna play different. You know, I love me some cancels, man. And as far as the new mechanic, it might make it feel like a different game. And I, that, to me, that's what Street Fighter V needed, but what do y'all think? But one more game, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the love. We'll see you soon. Peace. Blah, blah, blah. Subscribe.